Hello everybody, thank you for tuning in to Forgotten Films. And today's Forgotten Film star is Jackie Cooper. Jackie Cooper was born on September the 15th, 1922 in Los Angeles, California. His real name was John Cooper. He had family members in the film industry, including his uncle, who later became a director. But when he was two years old, his grandmother was uh, appearing in the films as an extra. As she started bringing little Jackie with her to auditions in the hopes to get more roles for herself. And what that actually achieved was him becoming an actor. He got his first role at the age of three, appearing in the Lloyd Hamilton comedies. In 1929, when he was seven years old, he was signed to a three-year, $50 a week contract with Hal Roach Studios. And in 1930, he appeared in his first hour gang short. It was entitled Boxing Gloves. Uh, Jackie Cooper was so adorable that he quickly outshined the other kids and went from being a uh, like bit player in the silence to um, a feature actor in the Our Gang talking comedies. He was so popular that in 1931, Hal Roach Studios lent him to Paramount to star in a movie that was being directed by his uncle entitled Skippy. His performance in this movie was so genuine that at age seven, he was the first child actor nominated for an Academy Award. And in 1931, Hal Roach Studios sold his contract to MGM. And the first films he appeared in under his new contract was entitled The Champ. It starred Wallace Berry, and that film was also nominated for an Academy Award. In 1932, his feet and hands were enshrined in concrete at the famous Grauman's Chinese Theater. Uh, Jackie Cooper was one of the few children who were actually able to transition from being a child actor to being a teen and then an adult in the industry. In all honesty, not an easy task. In 1942, he joined the Navy. During the Second World War, he did a stint in the South Pacific. After his initial four-year enlistment was up, he continued a career with the Navy. He was with the reserves until 1982. At his retirement, he was awarded the Legion of Merit Medal. In 1944, he married actress June Horn. In 1947, he returned to Hollywood and started making motion pictures again. In 1946, his son was born and he was divorced from June Horn in 1949. In 1950, he married Hilde Parks. They were married until 1954, and after their divorce is when he finally met Miss Wright. Her name was Barbara Ray Krause. They remained together until her death in 2009, and they had three children. In 1959, he began a career in television. One of the first series that he was on was entitled Hennessy. It was a military-based show, which he kind of sort of also used as a recruitment tool for the Navy. It was really popular. In 1978, he was offered the role of Perry White in the very first Superman movie, which he accepted 
and he continued as that character in Superman's 2, 3, and 4. His television career continued through the mid-1970s when he transitioned and began directing, which is what he continued to do until his official retirement from the industry in 1987. Jackie Cooper died on May the 3rd, 2011, in Santa Monica, California, of natural causes. He was 90 years old. He was the most decorated performer that served in the United States military behind Jimmy Stewart. And he was given a funeral with full military honors. He's buried in Arlington National Cemetery in Arlington, Virginia. During his 64 year career in the entertainment industry, he appeared in over 250 movies and television appearances. This includes his directorial roles. His star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame is located at 1507 Vine Street. And what I have for you today on Forgotten Films is a Christmas short starring Jackie Cooper. It's entitled The Christmas Party. In addition to having Little Jackie, it also has a whole bunch of the other uh, early MGM stars. In all honesty, this is one of my favorite performances from him. So I just want to thank you for tuning in and watching me today on Forgotten Films. Okay, have a great today and make sure that tomorrow is even better. Look at yourself. You're a sight. Ma, could I have the team over here for a Christmas party? The team? Yeah. There's only 11 of us and three substitutes. I just had the house cleaned and I don't want to get it all dirty. Well, I'll make them take off their shoes, Ma. Well, all right. Gee, but you're great, Ma. Good morning, Jackie. Good morning, Miss Cher. What's on your mind? Well, I'm in a lot of trouble. You are? Now, what sort of trouble can you be in? Well, I was given a Christmas party for the football team, and then, well, the team's sort of, sort of grown into an army now. <laughs> I certainly feel sorry for your poor mother. Well, lots of trouble, you know. All the rooters are coming to him. Well, the house ain't big enough. All right. Out with it. What do you want me to do? Well, I was just thinking if you could ask Mr. Mayor. 
if I could use one of his stages for my party. Mm-hmm. Well, I don't know, Jackie. I would like to help you out, but... Uh... Oh, gee, monsieur. You want me to be a mug in front of all those kids? <laughs> no, I don't. I tell you what I'll do. I'll go to the big boss and explain your big problem. See how much influence I have, hmm? Well, thanks, monsieur. <laughs> you know, now I wish Christmas came every day in the year. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, Le Fruge. <laughs> you know you're used to it. You oh. know you like it. Oh, no, I don't like that <laughs> stuff. Will you invite me to your party? Well, yeah, you can be a waitress yeah. or something, one of those Oh, things. that's how I rate, hmm? Yeah. yeah. Well, you know, you're too big to be eating turkey and things like <laughs> that. I mean... Oh. Listen, I bet I could put away as much turkey as you can. Oh, no. Yeah. Oh, no. Oh, I got too big a stomach. <laughs> I, got more, I got a bigger stomach than you have. <gasps> Thanks. I appreciate the compliment. <laughs> potatoes, gravy. Say, Mr. Gable, yes? my sister told me to tell you Merry Christmas. Well, thank you very much. Welcome. You wish it the same for me, will you? Yeah. Uh, oh, yes, by the way, uh, <clears throat> how uh, old is your sister? Fourteen. Oh, fourteen, eh? Yeah. <laughs> well, <clears throat> goodbye. How about some nice Christmas milk? Thank you, Greenwood. How about you? I don't want to get any fatter. Oh, go on. I drink it and look at me. My goodness me, look at that. Of course you're going to have some nice Christmas milk. <laughs> Who else wants some nice Christmas milk now? Now you drink that and when you drink that you can have some more. You want some too, Sonny? Nice hot biscuits? Thanks. They're hot. Oh, they can't be that hot. <coughs> Right. They're hot. Oh, give me your plate. I'll get you some more turkey. I want some more, too. I'll hurry up, will you? I am. <laughs> Don't worry. Take your time. There's lots more. You want me to do a bit of Mr. Edwards? Anybody else here? And the turkey got anything else beside a neck? Uh, why? Oh, the turkey. That's all I had was three necks. Well, here's a little rumble seat for you. Thanks. Yeah. Boy, look at my meat now. Yeah, what's the guy? Boy, meat turkey. And Yes, ma'am. When you come back, will you bring me some tea? Yes, ma'am. And bring me a napkin, too. Yes, sir. Merry Christmas, children. Merry Christmas. Say, Miss Davis, I know a guy that's stuck on you. Really? Who is this? Our professor. Oh, that's fine. If you give me a picture to take to him, he might let me skip a couple of grades. <laughs> well, you give him that. Maybe he'll put you in high school. What kind of pie do you boys like? What kind do you like, Miss Payne? Well, I kind of like pumpkin. All right, then make it pumpkin. Okay, pumpkin it is then. Pumpkin all around? Yeah. Really? All right. Hey,
Well, all I want to say is that well, all the folks that met your golden mayor wish you and all your folks a Merry Christmas and a very Happy New Year.